hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in today's video i'm going to be teaching you how to do a needle okay so this first stretch is really good for your armstrings and your shoulders you can see my hands are together pushing my chest towards my legs the second one is a lunge and you're going to use your hands to push your thigh closer to the ground i'll link a full leg stretching routine in the description below Okay, so this is a seal stretch and it's going to help for your back. While leaning backward, you're going to lean to the side and to the other side. Okay, this is another back stretch and you are going to rock back and forth in the back bend. If your back is not flexible enough, I'll be linking a full back stretch routine that will help you be more flexible in your back. These are arm rolls and it stretches your shoulders. Your shoulders play a very big part in your needle, so you should want to make them stretch before you attempt a needle. Okay, now this is a tricky one. With your legs straight and your hands on the wall, you're going to kick your legs up like in a needle position with your hands on the wall to support you. You don't need to have your splits to be able to do a needle. You can get your splits and your needle at the same time. But I advise to stretch your split. If you'd like to work on your split, I will link a tutorial below. Okay, now you're going to lean back and plant in this split. This will help you be comfortable in needle position. Okay, so this is a tricky one, but it works. It's helped me a lot in my needle. So basically, in this pose, you're going to straighten your legs. For beginners, you're going to try this and just slowly try to straighten your leg in the pose. This is very difficult. It will take years. You don't have to be straight. Your legs doesn't have to be straight, but just try to make it perfect. Okay, there are two ways to go into a needle. This is the first one. It is super tricky, but it helps with balance a lot. And there's the second way, the scorpion way. Okay, so now we're going to be following attempting the needle first into the scorpion pose. And, and you're going to move your hands back a little on your leg. And try to straighten your legs and this is the other method you're just going to grab your leg like this and then transit it into a scorpion and then straighten your legs a needle is one of the most advanced poses in contortion dance or whatever so don't be too hard on yourself just be consistent and you'll get it and watch me get my middle splits in the next video thank you so much for watching bye